How important is side spin? We're about to find out. When playing pool, whether it be eight ball or nine ball, playing with side spin or English, as it's also known, is very important. Why? Because we can manipulate the cue ball to take a different path from its natural angle. So in theory, we can put the cue ball where we want to make the finish easier. But can we clear the table without playing with side? This is something I've never tried one of you guys in the comments give me this idea. I thought it was a great idea, so whoever that was, thank you. In today's video, we're going to play some 8-ball and 9-ball. We're going to try and clear the table without using any side spin at all. So I'm going to start with some 8-ball. I'm not sure how long I'm going to do this video for. I'm kind of just going to roll with it. But I feel 8-ball is the game where you play more stop shots, more stun shots. You do play with side, of course, but... In nine ball, you spin the cue ball all over. So I think that's going to be pretty much impossible. Eight ball, there's half a chance. Let's try. Well, that was a pretty good break, actually. Oh, so straight away. Well, that's not too bad, actually, is it? Right, let's have a quick look. Right, I'm going to pot the 11. Because I can pot that. I could take on a risky 14, which is probably a bit more sensible. But it is a tougher pot. I'm going to take the 14 in the side. I can play that centre of the cue ball and just roll it through for the 10. And I'll tell you what, if I pot it, we haven't got a bad chance. And it's in. It is in. That was no side. So now I'm going to go 10, 9, 11, 13, 15. This is actually not a bad chance. As I said, no side is allowed. So I can draw the cue ball back. I can top it in. It's got to hit the centre line of the cue ball. Well, I would have liked that a little bit further out. <laughs> Tried to draw back a little bit, but that's not too bad. Oh, I think I might have put a bit of spin on that, you know. I think I did. This is really going to be weird for me because I feel like I play pretty much every shot with spin. <laughs> I know that might sound crazy, but I feel like I just automatically just sometimes I'm a little bit fatter, a little bit thinner and play it with spin and I feel like the cue ball span there. Yeah, I'm gonna re-rack. I'm not happy with that. I'm sure I played that with spin. Yep, yeah, let's re-rack. Oh I'm breaking well. Parking the light nice. It was another good break. Right, let's see what we've got. No excuses, but I've not hit any balls. I've just come straight in. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, I'm breaking unbelievable, which is a little bit weird. Six doesn't pass the eight, so I'm going stripes. And stripes are fine. Oh, it feels so weird hitting centre of the white. Right. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to punch this ball in. That's not bad. That is not bad at all. Pretty good. And I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. That's 
also weird because usually I play that with a bit of right spin. Oh, now I play this with loads of right spin and spin it round and come up here. <gasps> Goes in the top just past the two. And the ball's done run through, centre of the white. That is pretty good. And now I'm absolutely perfect. Okay, pool fans, eight ball completed, as I thought it would be. Let's see what nine ball has to offer. I'll rack again. Yes, we have a shot. Usually, I would stun this in and spin it with a bit of spin to come back out here. Just feels like a nicer shot, playing it with a bit of left. But of course, I'm not allowed. So I've got to play this centre ball, excuse me, and stun it round the back and straight away it just feels horrific it just doesn't feel natural at all usually I would queue up to it like this and just be putting if that's centre even half a tip to the left so this this is going to feel this is going to feel horrible trying to stun this in with no spin at all I might have missed a pot There, you could see the cue ball just acting a little bit weird. It didn't spin round right, but I'll take that. I'll take that indeed. I'm going to use the bridge. I've got a nice angle, so I can just pop this with a high ball, obviously in the centre, and just get it back down here. <laughs> Same again. I play this with a bit of left spin. Because I'm worried if I top this, will I go near the middle pocket? No, I don't think I will. And I'm focusing on just delivering the cue through straight. There we go. That needs to stop. That's all right. Well, I say it's all right. It's a little bit near the seven. Got a little bit giddy. But I can just play a stop shot. That's fine. Okay, that's all right. I'm gonna try and roll this in. I don't wanna be coming too near the rail. Well, that didn't go in clean, did it? That's all right. This all just feels really weird because even this shot I'd play with a bit of right spin. Just a little bit. I'm not saying I'd spin the granny out of it, but just a little bit. So now, anywhere in that middle. Oh, it just feels horrible. Ah. There you see the cue ball. I couldn't get it down there. I needed to play it with right English. And it's gone wrong. Bit of right English, I could have gone off there and down here to play the Karen. Now. I'm a dumb man here. I'm done. I've got to try and kick it in here. Playing ball, no spin.
Yeah, that's done. He's kicked it in. And now, centre ball. Wow. Playing pool with no side spin or no English is brutal. Now, in this video, I was quite fortunate with the splits I was getting. It allowed me to do it. And also, I think the vision that I had on, certainly in the eight ball, which way to take the pattern and making the correct decision helped. And in the nine ball, obviously, I managed to knock a good finish in. And obviously, the kick shot at the end. Well, Efren Reyes would have been proud of that one. So, playing pool with no spin is possible. But I would not advise it. Guys, if you've enjoyed this video, hit the subscribe button, smash the like, and I'll see you soon.